Good morning and welcome back to Summit Sunrise. I am with the wonderful Leah, the snow princess from Frisco. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. Thank you for joining me. Of course. You just, um, whenever you come in, you always have this like <laughs> infectious smile and this good attitude, which really is synonymous over at Frisco. And um, in fact, I think that your necklace sums it up. What does your <laughs> necklace say? It says, get your sparkle on. So Leah is feeling sparkly. And like I said, you're just looking snow princess. <laughs> Thank you, feeling sparkly this morning morning with my pink Frisco yeah, headband on. Your Frisco headband is so fun. I love that. It's perfect. And it's like I feel like these kinds of headbands are perfect when you go outside if you're going cross country skiing or snowshoeing. You know, like maybe not maybe not skiing or snowboarding, but yeah. It's perfect for when you're outside doing activities other than skiing and yes, snowboarding. Totally. And there's a lot of weight ponytail can hang out. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so um, what is this uh, this Frisco headband? It's for an event that's coming up. Is that right? It's the Romp to Stomp? Um, it used to be known as the Romp to Stomp. It's okay. the same event that everybody loves, but okay. now it's called the Snowshoe for a Cure. Snowshoe for, your, for a Cure. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep. Susan G. Komen of Colorado has mm -hmm. kind of stepped up and taken a bigger role and um, Tubbs Snowshoes has kind of stepped down a little bit and taken a smaller role. Oh, um, I see. Tubbs Snowshoes will still be there to um, demo. Outfit everybody, mm -hmm. okay. Mm -hmm. And all of the proceeds are going to Susan G. Komen of Colorado, just like they always have. So um, we're really excited. It's going to be a 3K walk, a 5K walk, and a little stomper dash. Oh, how great is that? So you have yeah. options. Yes. So you don't mm -hmm. you don't have to you don't have to you know you don't have to you know sign up for one in particular. There's all kinds. Right. Oh, and look, there's a pink party too. Yep. On and March that's 4th. on March fourth. Okay. Mm -hmm. We're doing that at the senior center this year, mm -hmm. and it's going to be from five to eight p.m. Okay. And so that's kind of a packet pickup, welcome mm -hmm. register reception. Nice. There's going to be snacks and drinks and games and Oh, that's cool. So it's not stuff. just packet pickup. It's like you guys have really done more than just packet pickup. Mm -hmm. Like you're making it a social event. Exactly. Which I yep. like because why <laughs> not, right? Totally. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yep. Okay. And that's on Friday and then on Saturday, um what exactly is going on? How, like take me through the day. Okay. So registration starts at 7:30 a.m. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. There's going to be pancakes there. <laughs> wow. Well, hello. <laughs> Yay. Um, and the event starts at, well, the Little Stomper Dash is at 8.45. Okay. The 3K, the 5K mm -hmm. is at 9.15. Okay. And the 3K is at 9.25. Perfect. So all in the morning, so you can be done with that and still have afternoon plans and make your afternoon plans, which I'm always a fan of. That's what I like about all these, um, the, ru the fun runs and, you know, these fun activities that you guys put on because you can still have, a, you know, afternoon and evening plans. Totally. Yep. And there's going to be... Um, a little pre-race Zumba to get you warmed up. Oh, cool! Super fun, and a little post-race group stretch. So, oh, that's always yeah. that's always helpful. I try to I try to remember <laughs> to stretch after I do fun activities like this. Sometimes I don't, and then I regret it the next morning. Mm -hmm. Totally. Um, but it sounds like you guys have really thought of everything for this. Um, and pre-race Zumba, really? Yeah, it's Are you super fun? Um, is Leah the Snow Princess leading this? Um, I won't be leading it, but I'll <laughs> definitely be shaking it out there. <laughs> oh, perfect. Okay, well, that is that's really good to know. Yeah. Um, so that is coming up on, starting on March 4th is when you can pick up your um, welcome packet. But it's, like I said, it's so much more than that. Mm -hmm. It's a reception as well. Yeah, it's going to yes. be fun. There's going to be games and prizes and um, some special in-town deals for pink party participants. So. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Sounds like all kinds. So if folks want to register, can you pre-register? Like what's the best way to do this? Yep. You can go to comancolorado.org okay. to get registered. Mm -hmm. And until March 3rd, it's yes. $45 for adults. Mm -hmm. And then on March 4th and 5th, it's mm -hmm. going to be $50. So okay. But all up. proceeds go to the Susan G. Komen of Colorado. Yep. And sometimes that makes people nervous because they're like, oh, what about my community? Right, right, but right. But 75% of the money raised is mm -hmm. going to go to come back to Summit County. Oh, wow. So that's awesome. And the other 25% goes to their grant program, Okay. which is, you know, um, Summit County residents are eligible for. So check out comacolorado.com mm -hmm. or dot org. Dot org, okay. Because there's a really um, heartwarming story about a woman, excuse me, from Fair Play who um, was able to benefit from mm -hmm. from that 25%, the part that doesn't go exactly oh, to Summit County. Okay. So everybody gets a little 
um, bite of it. So. Oh, okay. Well, that is really good to know. Mm -hmm. Leah, thanks yeah. for telling us. And um, coming in, I can think, I mean, I feel like unfortunately everybody knows someone who's been affected directly mm -hmm. or indirectly with breast cancer. And uh, so we can go to comancolorado.org for more information. This yeah. starts on March 4th over at the Frisco Adventure Park. At, um, actually, at the Senior Senior Center on senior Friday. Senior Center on Friday and then at the Adventure Park on Saturday. Saturday. And for all of you locals that think you're going to park at the Adventure Park, Think again because there's parking at the medical office building, the county commons, and the middle school. Oh, perfect. So we don't want to clog up the parking there and definitely don't park on Recreation Way. Okay. Because the buses need to get through to shuttle everybody through there. All right. So good to know. Well, yes. <laughs> Leah, thanks for informing all of us um, on all this. And um, you just keep being your fabulous Snow Princess <laughs> self of Frisco. Leah, thanks so much for joining me. Folks, head on over to comancolorado.org for more information. And we'll be back with more Summit Sunrise right after this.